Hello and welcome to another edition of Arbitration Studios as we continue our journey across the whole damn thing of Fallout New Vegas. I'm JP Arbiter. I'm Mrs. Arbiter. And Mrs. Arbiter, before we go on, uh, we blew up a bunch of ants for an NCR ranger out here and uh, he promised uh, he promised us uh, some equipment in return. Why don't we pay him a visit? Good plan. So, boop. Hello. Hi there. Howdy. You. Appreciate the help. Wish I had more work for you. <laughs> Nothing else on the radar at the moment. You mentioned a reward I before. You might accidentally get supplied, and I meant it. Not allowed to contract. <laughs> Still, a requisition form or two can get lost, and they're not going to come check. So here you. Service rifle. Nice. But things get lost. Things get lost. Stuff happens. So, service rifle, let's, uh... I mean, the varmint rifle is still valuable, but hey, we got ourselves a, uh, an AR-15 with wood furniture hmm. furnishings on the foregrip. Pistol grip and stock, which, okay, kind of cool. Kind of makes me want to do that with an actual uh, AR-15 rifle. <laughs> hmm. So. Certainly interesting. Also, someone once before mentioned that there was someone here who might offer us a job. You a courier? If so, this might be your lucky day. If you I like your hat. Bit. And your eyes. I like that your hair is poking through your hat. I think there's trouble in Nipton. No traffic from the No roads. traffic there from the roads. <laughs> the smoke from the town I can't. Sure. Alright. Look. I wouldn't check on to to look that in a Nipton. Yep. Well. Nipton, California. Funny story about Nipton. Uh, Las Vegas, Nevada, or, or Nevada itself, didn't have a state lottery until fairly recently. All the gambling, and they didn't have a state lottery. Yes. That seems... Weird? Weird, but at the same time, I can kind of get it, because they had Keno. <laughs> and Keno is as close to a lottery as, you, as you're going to get there. Well, Keno was, uh... Uh, was also kind of uh, looked down upon for a for a long time. So anyway, that meant that Nipton, California, mm -hmm. had for a protracted period of time uh, some of the highest lottery ticket sales in the country because people from Nevada. We're Went going there. to California to get their Powerball tickets. And Nipton's on the state line. Yep. I remember because I was looking at the potential of going there. <laughs> well, we are out that way. Just while exploring possibilities. Yep. Okay. All right. I will say that the long, the long 15 definitely... Lives up to that nickname. <laughs> yep. It feels longer than I-70 in, Al in Illinois. <laughs> All right. <clears throat> and has about as many restroom stops as... as I-70 in I Illinois. I-70 in Illinois. <laughs> <clears throat> Do you hit the cross? You got about two hours of nothing. <laughs> Maybe one. Yeah, a little bit of context when you're driving uh, on Interstate 70 through Illinois. You hit a town called Effingham, and you know you've hit a town called Effingham because there is a 10-story tall, uh, like, metal cross. You wonder if it's a Transformer and it's going to become Optimus Prime or just some random battle mech or something. Well, Optimus Prime is Jesus. True. Optimus Prime is better than Jesus. Because uh, Optimus Prime has actually come back. 
That Re- is true. Refute me. <laughs> I can't. <laughs> More than once, pending the pending the game you're looking at. Uh huh. Game or context? No, no. Uh, Optimus Prime has come back to life on multiple occasions, even before uh, his return in the season after Transformers the movie. <laughs> because, as we all know, Hot Rod sucks. Ooh, random encounter. Oh, one of these days our youngest son's going to hate us for that nickname. <laughs> but it fits the context. It just just for the listening audience, the con- it happens to be Roderick. <laughs> so it fits. Oh, it was only his obsession with cars that you started calling him Hot Rod. Yeah, it just happened to fit perfectly. I'll set our whole two name scheme. But it worked. Yep. <laughs> anyway. Ants. Giant ants! Makes me think of a, of some eerie images of floods and sea of, and this mound of fire ants. No, I don't want that. Because those... Well, hell, oh. lady. I'll just let you take care of everything. I begin to wonder if ants float on the bodies of the other ants just to stay alive. Like an Ant-Man? Yeah. Alrighty. Yeah, we don't want to go into that dry lake bed. There there be ants there. Mm, yeah. All right. That'd be anticlimactic. <laughs> oh. Oh, sweetheart, your D&D game is tomorrow. Save the puns. <laughs> oh, they will be flying. They will be flying. Jekyll gang. Naturally. It does make me wonder how the idea oh. of the formation of gangs with the new with the upcoming Fallout will be. Oh, since uh, since uh, Fallout 76 is all players, no NPCs. Mm-hmm. I mean, I know they're I know how they're going to pull it off. They're going to have it like those are the clan groups, clans or raider camps or whatever. Or whatever, yeah. There's no easy way to phrase that. Well, hell, I don't know what they're going to do. So you're one step ahead of me. Okay. The bigger problem is with no NPCs, how the hell do you have... Uh, quests, Boss, holotapes, have... and radio transmissions is how mm-hmm. they're going to do it. Oh. But I mean, like, bosses. Well, there are going to be plenty of monsters in Fallout 76. And from what I understand, also, um, <clears throat> a not feral but not fully sapient faction of ghouls called the Scorched. Hmm. Huh will be prevalent. Uh, in the uh, West Virginia wasteland. I don't know what to call that area. I, it's, it's just sad you can't have it set up where your character can turn can like turn into a ghoul or be a ghoul. Yeah, that, that's something that's... That's something that was a point that was missed. <laughs> well, Fallout 4, there's the ghoulish... Uh, perk where you get the uh, perks that are associated with ghouls uh, in terms of uh, being able to rapidly heal radiation damage uh, Mm. and and being irradiated also gives you uh, some healing benefits and whatnot but that it but uh, that that particular perk was was uh not well received and very few players from what I understand actually took it. Hmm. I know I've never taken it. Rad scorpions. Okay. Thank you, Edie. It's 
It's only because of Edie that I can see that far. <laughs> so, let's go on to Nipton. Yes, let's. <clears throat> Nipton, California. Which shows the scope of the game, because Nipton, California is about... 40 miles south? Yeah, thereabouts. Based on a real town, so... Yeah, well, I mean, when you look at the uh, map here, I mean, there's... Here's Nipton, California, Prim, Nevada, and Good Springs is that they they got they kind of got it a little. They kind of got it a little off, but it was it's close. It's it's off from Prim Prim is is or Good Springs in relation to Prim. They're like right across highway from each other, but Gene, Nevada, and um. And Sloan, Nevada. I mean, that's those four towns are basically in a nice little tight square. Um, <clears throat> there is no town called Novak. That's based off of like five different pit stops along highways. Uh, Searchlight, Nevada, is over here, and mm-hmm. that's a real place. And that's roughly I, the state line, the California. Uh, the California Nevada state line basically runs right here. Yeah, pretty much. So and Nipton's just passed. Although in the case of the little dinosaur, Nipton is actually further inland and in, in, inside California is what it's based off of. Yep, and it exists, but it's not where they say it is. And right here, right here, Las Vegas Boulevard. Yep, the Strip. So. Um, so technically they have the strip in the North Strip, don't they? Yes. Okay. Just a curiosity of mine. Did you see that? That crazy bitch just attacked me out of nowhere. Um, I just got here. No, none at all. We've been traveling together since <laughs> I picked her up a few... We'd actually been flirting a little when she suddenly... Now that I think of it, though, she laughed when I threw her my money. Lucky yeah. charm necklace? Someone's gonna turn on you. On it. They're pretty rare, so I started collecting. I have a really. Once I had enough, I made a necklace out of them. Since. I... Oh. 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 Lucky for me. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Whack. She had this really cool charm necklace on her, made out of all the star caps. Yep, mine. Mine. <laughs> ah. <laughs> All righty. Hard not to love that mo- those moments. Nipped in California, and it's on fire. Well, ain't that pleasant? Like the fellow once said, "Ain't that a kick in the head?" Mm-hmm. Yeah! Who won the lottery? I did! Smell that air! Couldn't you just drink it like booze? <laughs> are you are drunk? F- are you feeling alright? Are you kidding me? <laughs> are you drunk, high, or both? Yeah. All of the, both or all of the above? What sort of lottery did he win? Lottery. The lottery. I'm assuming his lottery was his life. <laughs> Only lottery that the exact <coughs> opposite of the... Are you a powder ganger? Powder ganger? What? I mean, yeah, used to be, sure. But not no more. Powder gang is small time, man. I'm a winner! I won the motherfucking lottery! <laughs> Bye. <laughs> when the prize are winning the lottery is your life, there's something wrong. Wasn't there a short story about that that's like really big in high schools oh yeah only the winner of that lottery is drawn is drawn out and stoned mm-hmm pretty much hello what is it this time what happened this time the legion happened what the, the fuck? legion happened ooh dun dun oh, no. dun Just love it here what the fuck do you think, asshole? Prize mm. of second place was I got to live, but they beat me. Prize of second place, she got oh, crippled. Oh shit! 
Well, that's pleasant. <laughs> right. I'm not sure I even want first place if that's wow. what your lottery gives you. <laughs> no kidding. Unfortunately, I don't have any Medex to give him, which is too bad if I gave him enough. Then, uh... Well, he wouldn't be able to become a... He doesn't, he's not one to become a companion. Right? Well, no, he doesn't become a companion, but if I... Okay, oh, buddy. that's pleasant. Who do are you and what do I shoot? Don't worry. I won't have you lashed to a cross like the rest of these degenerates. It's useful that you happen by. I want and thus we are introduced to Caesar's Legion and my favorite character among them, Walpus and Kalta. I want you to teach everyone you meet the lesson. The chief spymaster. Hmm. Especially any NCR troops you run across. He's got a All I can think is a cult. <laughs> what lessons did you teach Where here? Where to begin? That they are weak and we are strong. This much was known already. But the depths of their moral sickness, their dissolution, Nipton serves as the perfect object lesson. What exactly happened Nipton here? Nipton was a wicked place, debased and corrupt. Define wicked. It served all comers. Not, as they paid. not fitting with their Profit moral standards. Powder gang. That's why I mean, define wicked. Myself, <laughs> the people here didn't care. Not them. It was a town. Of whores. Okay. For a pit Got it. The town agreed to lead those it had sheltered into a trap. Only when I sprang it did they realize they were caught inside it too. Yes. Yes. And herded them to the center of town. I told them their sins. The foremost being disloyalty. Their si primary died, sin is disloyalty. Some are punished. The others made to watch. And I announced the lottery. Each clutched his tip, but loyalty to him. set him free. That's what did nothing. It always amazes me how it's interesting. <coughs> how a group of people can be easily cowed by a strictly inferior number of men just because they are armed. Once did they try to resist? They stood and watched. And fellows were butchered. Walpus uh, pointed that out right there. Mm -hmm. One by one, they stood. Well, their turn it's would just not like um, something I think the movie Ants itself. shows. They don't always, you don't always realize the. As are all crimes, if you feel strong. The about ability it, and the power that a mob and a larger group has when they bind together. And off they go. Should we report this? Yes. I think so. All right. Mostly because let him know. Logic. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> hi. Two thirds of you are gonna be strapped to a cross, or a third of you are gonna be strapped to a cross. A third of you are gonna be put into a pyre, and another third of you are gonna be decapitated. What? There's no way. Not exactly your lucky day. One's gonna go free and another one's gonna get his legs cracked. Thanks for... <laughs> Alright. The things that people will do because they think it's a good idea. <laughs> yeah, no kidding. I just love people. You check out the Nipton Don't Town you? Hall yet? <laughs> Legion this far west? You're fucking kidding me. Nope. <laughs> Everyone's got a mouth on them. Fast. Nipton wasn't the most fr <sighs> All right. Thanks for checking on that. In Nipton? Hell no. Hell no. Town was a sh Well, thanks for hoofing it there. Fucking Mojave's going to hell. <laughs> and all I hell in a handbasket. Yep. I do tissue. <laughs> All right. Well then, not much for it. Off Every time we pass the statues they erected, I still get amazed at the brick and at the. 
how they were built in the engine. Well, yeah. You can see how they were built. It's just neat to see. <laughs> neat, Uh-oh. but creepy. Oh, bark scorpions. All bark, no bite. Oh, no. Bark scorpions are very nasty. I'm um, joking. <laughs> I, I've had a couple of encounters with them in my youth. So, uh... I'm... I'm not being serious, honey. I'm... Maybe, but I am. It's just like that line with... The line in... The crystal skull. (laughs) How big is it? When it comes to scorpions, the bigger the better. All right. <clears throat> Welcome to Nevada. The Silver State. And what's on the other side? Welcome to California. <laughs> is hibiscus a flower for California? Uh, is that a hibiscus flower? Looks like it. Oh. I know hibiscus is the state flower of Hawaii. Hmm. I think just because of the warm weather and... Hibiscus tend to thrive in warm weather. Yeah. Just why the two trees we have are still... are still happy. <laughs> <laughs> the only things we're keeping alive are the trees. And a few other flowers, too. Anyway. Oh! Oh! I, I'm kind of... Okay, hu- that's... I'm kind of hungry for some goat. Are you hungry for some goat? Mmm. Sure you can't save the horns for a gauntlet or something. Shield. Splat! Be a sexy shield. (laughs) (laughs) Ah. Yay, big horner meat. Oh, and we leveled up. All right. Junk rounds allows us to make stuff. Stuff out of scrap metal and tin cans. We don't need that. Cherez la femme. If we want to make our character bisexual. Ooh, friend of the night. Mm. Uh, Eyes adapt quickly in low light conditions and when darkness falls across a wasteland. Hmm. Hunter, 75% critical damage against animals and mutated animals. Intense training, boost to special. Don't need that. Retention, don't need that. Swift learner, really don't need that. Mm -hmm. Uh, cannibal. We can eat people. (laughs) Okay. The good boar it is. Um, good old fashioned bloody mess. Characters and creatures (laughs) will explode, will often explode into a red gut ridden eyeball strewn paste and 5% damage with all weapons. I love bloody mess. (laughs) That's a fun one. Gunslinger, Lead Belly, Mad Bomber. Or Toughness. We get a plus three to overall damage threshold. Ooh. Um, but you want Bloody Mess, we want Bloody Mess. Let's have a Bloody Mess. Yes, because Bloody Mess is amusing as hell. Especially when you do it with, like, a little itty dinky. Uh, gun of some type. Mm-hmm. Because, you know, a two twenty three caliber rifle is deadly, but it shouldn't make people explode. Yes, very true. And when it does, it is a hilarious thing. <laughs> to quote Vegeta in Dragon Ball Z Abridged, Why did I explode? Now, whole reason why I went up this way, there's an 
ambush coming. Oh. You're trying to avoid the ambush, aren't you? I am. Uh -huh. Whoa, crap. Did you not avoid it anyway? <laughs> um. Or was that not, uh, not part of the ambush? Um, apparently I done fucked up. That guy has a grenade launcher. I'm going to relieve him of it. <laughs> that was not my best. No, no, but... 40 millimeter grenade, bottle cap. Shame you can't lob our dynamite that far out. No. And at that range, even the grenade launcher I have won't reach. Oh, that bugger. Oh, did she heal herself? Like, scarfed some food or something? Oh, yeah, I think for the first time ever when playing this that so, that the game either spawned people up here or they ran up here. Huh. Because normally they're in this ditch waiting for me to pass. Oh. Legion mongrel. That's I've got... I have no beef with the Legion, ergo I am not going to mess with that. For now, stay friendly. Exactly. Ave, true to Kaisar. Or as Mr. New Vegas says, keep it classy, Vegas. <laughs> Even though we're not listening to the radio right now, it still feels kind of weird watching <laughs> watching the playthrough and thinking of all the all the randomness. After we actually met him. After we met Wayne Newton, yeah. <laughs> yeah, that was a, the weirdest. It's a strange connection, but he's so personable, too. Well, you know, you don't get to be in show business for 66 years and not learn how to work a crowd. Oh, yeah. Really quick save, because I've been known to encounter... Glitches there? A uh, game crash around here. Particularly around that ranch. Oh, fun times with hand grenades. Yep. Oh, also... <clears throat> we got a caravan here. Woohoo! Let's, uh... Let's see, who's the actual merchant? Mercenary, mercenary, traveling merchant. Anything? Yes, let's see what you got. Um, I'm just gonna watch you guys go past this, uh... Oh, no, you're gonna go past that billboard up there and watch y'all get slaughtered. It's gonna be fun times. Do, 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 do. And do, do. Here we go. And sometimes they kind of come out on top, and sometimes they get their ass kicked. Oh, yeah. Nature of One. any fight. One to two ratio now. Up. Up. Oh, she's still alive. She's still alive. That's that save Decker moment. <laughs> well, that 
was amusing. It totally was. And suddenly you cannot carry everything. Oh, that's <laughs> supposed to die in. <laughs> okay. So he likes blue underwear except when I take it off. Part of the uniform, I guess. I guess. Considering that you... <laughs> oh, that's hilarious. All right. Now we go. Come with me, come with me, hold me. Together we'll break these chains of love. No? No. <laughs> you never let me sing. No, I don't. Oh, hey. Look out there in the distance. It's like a giant boob coming out of the desert. What? See that dome-like thing? It's like I a... see the dome-like thing. I'm just still like, what? It's a giant boob coming out of the desert. It even has a nipple on top. Oh, we got another gunfight going on. <laughs> oh, more vipers. That's pleasant. Aww. Whack! Such a lawless place. It really is. Oh, how cute. He has metal armor. How cute. He won't have it for long. Because he opened it. It will be mine. And you will call it Squishy. <laughs> Hello, Squishy. <laughs> Suddenly, I just realized the most, th the funniest thing you could ever pull together. Oh. An octopus in armor. <laughs> Arm-er. Uh -huh. That's... <laughs> I don't know whether to be ashamed of you or proud of you. <laughs> just be happy. Yes. Just be happy. <laughs> Either way, that w that was a truly impressive pun. <laughs> oh, hi, Gecko. Gonna Gecko. Gecko. <clears throat> I'm rocking a five-five-six rifle, and yet those shells come out. Look like they're the size of golf clubs. <laughs> Graphics. Graphics! Stuff! Things! Every time I see them, see the different critters going around, I keep on thinking, can you skin it? Can you skin it? Can I skin it? Well, no, in World of... Um, the short time I did play World of Warcraft, one of the big things was... You skinning skin for everything. The was you skin everything for the leathers. And then you sell the leathers. Mm-hmm. Or you make things and then sell. I haven't played it in ages, and I don't really intend to. It's gotten so detailed, and I just got bored with all the quests. <laughs> it's the same story with uh, Destiny. Mm-hmm. It's enjoyable. You, re you reach mm -hmm. a certain... Although Destiny helped you get better at first-person shooters. It did. I'll still jump on it every now and again if I... In the mood. Hmm. So, they made. The NCR made an outpost out of a bunch of trailer homes. Well. If it wikes. Yeah, what else are you gonna do with it? I. It's not like you're gonna make a mansion out of it or anything. Stamped aluminum. Ooh, sunglasses. Sweet. Uh, stamped aluminum isn't exactly bulletproof. It's just the point mm, that I'm no, trying to get across. No, it isn't, but it has a little more protection, and there's a concrete barrier around. Yeah, that is bulletproof. Yeah, the concrete barrier is the good thing. <laughs> it's All a right. really good thing. Everything else is just like, okay, there's this thing here. I don't know what this thing does. Does something. Speaking of thing and not knowing what it does, here's Ranger Station Charlie. 
Uh huh. And here is Ranger Station Charlie's comm officer Stepanic. Stepanic. McCarran doesn't like it when civilian. With your rad, red hair. Radio signal out here. When it happens enough, I'm a no. Ranger. All I can think is how people manage to adapt to survive in that kind of Box atmosphere down. without Park. air conditioning. Couple dozen. Right? Just knowing how hot it was when we were there. The Rangers mostly. And that was more of your average summer day. <laughs> Just wow. So strange. Worried about me stealing a tin can that's on the ground. Really? Next thing I know, if I drink out of the toilet, they're gonna get pissy. Oh, got ourselves a wild dog. Puppy. Puppet. <laughs> oh, but you're not sad that I had to kill the puppy? It's an ex-puppet now. It's an ex-puppet. <laughs> God. <laughs> <clears throat> Sorry, I'm a little perky tonight. Happens. <laughs> All right. And there is our goal, Novak. Named after a no vacancy seaside. Yep. Um, Good Springs was originally supposed to be called No-So. <laughs> for no soliciting. Uh. Eh. Kind of um, glad it wasn't. Because that would have been weird. Yep. And you don't want to be weird. Actually, Novak was a uh, legacy of uh, when they were uh, building the alpha of the game because it was the uh, first town that they built mm -hmm. and before they really did any study of the uh, surround of Las Vegas and the surrounding area geographically. Oh. So that's why it's in the middle of nowhere and unincorporated Nevada and has absolutely nothing to do with it because they hadn't done any of the game design for us. They just wanted to work with the engine, so... Oh, so that it was more of their playtime with it to see what you can... see what you can throw on a dartboard and it will stick. Yep. I can And that. they just kept it. So, anyway. Here we are in Novak. See? Novak. Novak. Yep. <laughs> and we will continue our journey next time. We'll be seeing you, kids. <laughs>